Hello all. Today I want to show you another uh, Excel trick. I'm going to show you a uh, privilege escalation from uh, Excel without uh, creating any processes. So let's log in on this uh, Windows 7 machine as a normal user, so I'm not an administrator with this Lua account. Okay. Let's go to my documents. So and I'm going to run Process Explorer as an administrator just so that you can follow along which processes are created. So you see I'm not an administrator, I need to type the password. Okay, and here we have Process Explorer running. So what I'm going to do now is uh, start my um, Excel tools that contain a uh, command line and, and regedit and that is uh, something all something I did a couple of years ago. This here launches uh, a command line but all is done inside the Excel process itself. Okay, So you can see here I have a command line but if you go have a look here to Process Explorer you see Excel has no sub-process and this command line uh, window is actually part of Excel. Let me show you like this. I select this window and you see that it belongs to the Excel process. So this is uh, a command line that I took uh, from ReactOS, changed it in uh, a DLL and then I'm running this inside uh, Excel by running a DLL from memory into memory. Okay, but, but that's all uh, old stuff. What I want to show you now is a, a privilege uh, escalation. So, who am I? Shows that I am uh, the LUA uh, account. I'm not privileged. So, if I do, for example, a net local group administrators, here you can see that root is a member and uh, if I try to add myself this fails because I'm not an administrator but uh, this is going to change because here in my directory I have a DLL that allows me to uh, do a privileged escalation this uh, comes from uh, Metasploit it's an exploit for CV 2014-4113, quite recent. And here in my command line, I've also added an extra command, that's a DLL command. The DLL command allows me to load a DLL into the Excel process. And I can do this into memory without load library with option slash M. So let me do that. DLL slash m and that's the cve dll okay and as you can see here it successfully executed and i have executed a privilege escalation if i do a om high now you can see that i am nt authority system well if you go to process explorer it still lists lua as the owner but i performed a privilege escalation if I do, for example, now a CMD, you can see that the sub-process is created, CMD here, and that it runs as NT authority system. So let's go out of this, and now, as a last thing, I'm going to do a net local group administrators Lua add and this was successful I can now net add myself to the group of uh, administrators now I did this with uh, Metasploit uh, exploit for CV 2014-4113 um, I just made some small changes to uh, the Cisco source code and then recompiled it first of all here in the beginning I removed uh, the 
reflective DLL injection stuff from Metasploit because I don't need that anymore. Uh, I have my own uh, method to do this, so I remove that reflective DLL injection. I enable debugging, and here at the end you can see that I just disabled the create the execution of the payload because I don't need any payload. I just want to elevate Excel, and then I can work with my own tools.